Hi guys, Sai is here back with another interesting and most important video. And today in this video, I'm going to talk about how to unlock any company Android device bootloader without any waiting time, without any permission. This method is instant unlock method, but this is little bit risky method because we are going to do unofficial method. Yeah, guys, we are using paid tools to unlock our device bootloader. Okay, so watch this video till the end. So don't skip any part of this video. Okay, because in this method, your device is gonna break. Don't worry. Uh, this is a soft brick. You can unbrick it with using paid tool. Okay, you need to buy paid tool or you can uh, contact with our admin. He will also provide you paid service. Okay, let's jump on process. I will show you. I will explain you all the things step by step. Okay, so let's begin the process. So for example purpose here it is. I'm using Xiaomi device and I'm not logging my Xiaomi account. Okay, no need of Xiaomi account. No matter which company device you are using. Okay. And most important point you know to need that your device CPU. So my device CPU is Qualcomm CPU. So need to open the back panel. If you are MTK, if your device uh, is MTK based, so no need to open back panel. But if your device is based on Qualcomm, then definitely you need to open your device back panel. So my device CPU is Qualcomm. So that's why I open my back panel. Okay. For more information, you can uh, join our telegram channel and also you can uh, contact with our uh, admin. He will help you to unlock your device bootloader. Okay. So as you can see, first of all, you need to download your device fast boot room. Okay. Your device stock room because in you, if your device is going to break, so you need to unbreak it now. So that's why you need to have your stock latest stock firmware, latest stock room of your device. I already downloaded it. You need to download it. For example purpose, here it is. I'm using one of the paid tool, which is unlock tool. You can uh, use any other tools. A lot of different uh, uh, paid tools is available like Miracle, UMT, okay, Hydra tool, a lot of tools uh, available of you can search on Google and find it or you can contact with our admin. He will help you. Okay. So for example purpose, I am using this unlock tool. Okay. I will give link on pin comment. So you will able to find list of supported devices for unlocking your device bootloader. For example purpose, here it is the list. As you can see, a lot of uh, devices is present and on the right side, the unlock support is uh, available or not you can check from here as we can see in so this is one of the paid tool which is unlock tool i will provide link of this tool on pin comment this is paid tool okay or you can talk with our admin i will provide id of admin on pin comment so you can contact with him or you can join our telegram channel okay here it is one important point which you note to need that this tool supports some specific devices so you need to check list from here a lot of different type of paid tools is present so you need to find out in which tool your device unlocking bootloader is support okay so here it is i open this tool okay i install this tool double click on this tool so i already buy subscription of this tool so that's why for showing purpose okay as you can see this video is for educational purpose only okay so as you can see here it is i am going to unlock my redmi note 7s device bootloader okay for example purpose i select me from top of the left after that go on security then select your uh, device simply you can search device from this search option okay after that you need to connect your device on edl mode for connecting your device in EDL mode, you need to open back panel of your device and short the EDL points of that device. Simultaneously, when short your devi uh, device EDL points, then you need to connect your device with PC through USB. Okay. So first turn off your device, then unplug the battery connector. Okay. For Qualcomm devices, you need to short EDL points simultaneously. You need to connect USB cable with your PC. If you are uh, media, your device uh, is media tech CPU, then no need to open back panel. You simply turn off your device and hold volume up and volume down and connect your device with PC. Then MTK port is connected. So in my case, my device is Qualcomm. So that's why I open the back panel and short the EDL points and then connect the device with PC. Okay, then here it is the unlock option. Click on this unlock option, then it will unlock in few seconds your device. Okay, after unlock your device gonna soft break. Note this point. Okay, 
so you know to need this point so when the process is done on the bottom the done is shown as we can see the process is done okay as we can see the process is done and port is disconnected now what is next step now connect your uh, battery connector with phone and hold volume uh, sorry power button until the screen turn on when screen turn on then you need to boot your device on fast boot mode for that you need to press again volume button and volume down button volume down and power button you need to first turn off your device and unplug the battery connector then reconnect battery connector okay then unplug the usb now as you can see unplug the battery connector reconnect the battery connector now you need to boot your device on fast boot mode for that press volume down and power when screen is turn on then leave the power button but don't leave volume down button okay you need to find out what is the fast boot combination keys for your device so simply google it okay and if you don't know what is ideal points oh i missed what is ideal points if you don't know how how to find ideal points then google it okay let me note 7s ideal points poco f1 ideal points so you need to find yourself ideal points okay after when you connect with pc as you can see here it is this fast boot uh, device is connected in fast boot mode as you can see phone is connected in fast boot mode note this point when you connect your device on fast boot mode check once on command window simply install platform tools or adb 15 seconds you don't you know about it how to install i will provide link on description how to install 15 for optional this method is optional for checking purpose your device is connected on fast boot mode or not so i am showing you how to check the device on fast boot mode as you can see my device is connected on fast boot mode okay now as you can see the bootloader status is still locked why because we need to unlock our device bootloader on fast boot mode also first we unlock our device bootloader in ideal mode i think you remember okay previously we unlock our device bootloader in ideal mode but still we need to again unlock our device in fast boot mode that's why it's showing false our device bootloader status is un unlocked not unlocked that's why it show false now i am repeating one more time to unlock my device through fast boot first we unlock bootloader wise ideal wise now we need to unlock in fast boot so click on fast boot then click on this continue yes okay make sure your device connected in fast boot mode okay when you click on unlock in fast boot mode as you can see unlock is done it say okay now our device is unlocked successfully okay now as we can see our device blinking okay our screen is like um, appears like this because our device is in brick mode but our device bootloader is unlocked so again i am going to show you after unlocking bootloader in fast boot mode with the help of pet tool after when we check on pet tool or oh sorry after we when we check on command window as you can see now unlock status is true right in previously when we unlock through ideal mode with the help of pet tool it says false now we again repeat this thing on fast boot now it says true that means bootloader is unlocked successfully as you can see now you can flash your device again through on ideal mode or you can use command window to flash okay because bootloader is unlocked but here it is i am already on pet tool so i am going to flash my device in ideal mode so select here you need to select firmware from here as we can see downloaded latest firmware here it is this is the folder open the folder one select images then click okay then click on simply flash but before we going to flash our device first we connect our device in ideal mode so that now i am disconnect this now short the ideal points then click on flash now our device flashing started so as we can see i connected in ideal mode now flashing is started as we can see okay so it will take little bit of time because need some more time to flash this entire firmware you can repeat same process for mediatek devices mediatek cpu devices just connecting method is different okay so for connecting mediatek device you need to 
just hold volume up and volume down then connect the usb cable okay then your device connected and remaining process is same now it flashed successfully now connect your uh, battery connector now hold power button okay as we can see redmi logo is came now unlock status is also showing on top of okay that means bootloader unlocking is done without any permission instant unlock okay i'm going to set up rapidly after that i show you the bootloader unlocked successfully or not okay so our bootloader is unlocked successfully let's show you i will show you it's unlocked or not wait so as we can see the bootloader is unlocked successfully this is the method very very simple method very fast method but little bit risky method so you need to note every small point okay so see you in the next video if you like this video please like and share this video love you guys goodbye take care